Hey there everybody, this is CP Cards and Dice. Now I wanted to uh, start a quick discussion, it's not going to take me very long, to uh, look at um, infield in situation. There's two basic situations with the infield in. Now the actual um, chart where the, where the explanation is done, where the infield in situation is presented was a, a a little convoluted for me so i contacted joe directly and i had him clarify and this is this is this here is what he sent me so i wanted to share it with you all uh this is not going to be a long video but i did want to really basically um just share my my understanding of a general approach when you're thinking about the infield in the whole purpose of it is to get the runner at home out or keep him from scoring have him hold now with the bases loaded he's forced to advance uh, to advance whereas with the bases are not loaded he is not forced to advance and those are the two choices here that uh, Joe sent me with the bases loaded you look at the uh, mini chart above where two to five the batter is out the runner holds this is with the bases not loaded Six to eight, the runner on third is out at home. He decides to go. Nine to ten, the ball sneaks past the drawn in infield. And then 11 to 12, roll on the play at the play chart, which is another chart in the regular rules uh, page. Now, um, I want to say that in my home brew rules, because I, I manage both teams and and I don't want to, if I'm playing a whole season, I don't want to drag out and, and make these decisions uh, really lengthy. So basically, I have a simple rule that with nobody out, runner third holes, if he can, of course, with the bases not loaded. But with one out, if he's not a slow catcher, then he's going to try to score. Okay, and then I have, I have the opportunity to throw him out at the plate if I try for, for that. It all depends, right? So um, that's my house rule for that. Now with the bases loaded, obviously here it is, it's two to six, right? Runner on third is out at home. Seven to eight, runner on third is out at home, batter safe. So actually two to six is a double play. Seven to eight is runner, uh, the batter is out at home, but everybody else advances. And then nine to 10, ball sneaks through the infield. And 11 to 12, re-roll on the infield in uh, play at home chart. So that's about it. So it's pretty straightforward. If you want to take a picture of this, uh, let me know. I'll put it up on the, on the uh, Facebook group site. And you can have this, and you can print it out, and you can use it. This was uh, something Joe sent me to clarify what I saw as a bit uh, uh, unclear on the rules as written. Thanks, guys.